Hello! Yes, you have clicked. Welcome to my channel, Mary Creative Corner. If you're visiting for the first time, you are welcome. If you're returning subscribers, thank you for always coming back. I truly appreciate you all. So today, I would like to show you how to make a yam porridge or uh, potato porridge. So if you want to know how this dish is going to turn out, stay tuned while I show you how. It's going to be delicious. I'm going to use these few ingredients you're looking at here to create this amazing dish. And I wish you are here with me to try it out and see what I'm talking about. Okay, let's go straight to the business. I am going to use this pepper, sweet peppers. I'm going to use one onions. I'm going to use thyme. I'm going to use squash bonnet. And I will be using um, this naan. I will be using salt. And I will be using these three tomatoes and my olive oil as usual. So if you have palm oil, it is one of the chief ingredients. But today, I just want to try it out without palm oil to see how it's going to turn out. So feel free to substitute your oil to palm oil but i'm gonna use olive oil so the redness for this recipe is gonna come from my peppers and my tomatoes okay in here i just slice my tomatoes and my peppers sweet peppers so i'm placing them in this my blender i'm going to blend them and part of the onions as well i will leave some to fry Here's my yam. It's already been prepared. It's been peeled, washed, cut, and ready to go into the pot. Okay, guys, I'm ready to. I just pour them out. Here I will pour some onion, tomato, and the pepper mixture. So I'm gonna fry for a little while. And then I'll come back and add my yam into it. Okay, guys. Okay. And then add water. I don't go in the water. Adding salt, I'm adding thyme. So I'm going to add my yam now. Yeah. I'll color and cook until it's soft and tender. So guys, this is how it's looking like. I just added some meat to it. I'm gonna dish it out now in a bowl. Okay guys, this is our yam porridge. Look at how rich it looks. So the, the sweet peppers, paprika, and the tomatoes, were able to bring out this rich red color. I always like to garnish my meal, so this time I garnished with um, spinach. So let's go ahead and then dig into it, and then we can tell whether it tastes nice or not. So the yam is pretty tender, as you can see. So the sauce is very important for this type of meal. It tastes delicious. Really nice, guys. I encourage you to give this a try. And if you like it, please do not leave without uh, giving this video a thumbs up. I'm subscribed if you haven't subscribed already. Thank you so much. Stay blessed. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye. <laughs>